everybody, Jeff with RV Optimizer here. And uh, I know typically we work on B and C class RVs, but today I've got something a little different for you. If you're that person who loves to go path less traveled um, or create your own path altogether, I've got something here for you that is this earth roamer that uh, is amazing. And I, to tell us more about it, I've got Zach here with me. Zach, introduce yourself a little bit and tell us what we're going to be walking through. Yeah, so my name is Zach. I'm the customer experience manager for earth roamer. Um, and this is the new 2023 Earth Roamer SX. So this is going to be a little bit larger model that we just announced at SEMA this past year um, that is going to be based on the Chevy 6500. So a little bit larger platform for us, also a, uh, a new chassis, a new OEM for us. Um, it's gonna be four feet longer than our typical uh, Earth Roamer LTI, and that gives us a little bit more space for uh, other options and we'll talk about those when we get inside but things like washer dryer and a second bed and all those fun things. okay so now we're inside this thing zach tell us what we're looking at here so this is the inside of the new earth roamer sx so this is going to be four feet longer than our other model um, that extra length gives us a lot more space inside so some of the big highlights that we have for this model are going to be uh, the bunk area up above the cab is going to be a california king um, in the rear of the truck, we have our large dining area now. Now this dining area can seat, I would say, six to eight very easily. But one of the other nice things is that the table with a push of a button can actually drop all the way down. And when it drops down, it, this becomes your second California King. So we're getting a lot more space uh, and a lot more sleeping within a very, still a very small envelope. Um, some of the other things we have uh, are going to be three-sided glass windows up in the dining room area. So when you're sitting up there, you have uh, views all the way around. We have the TV that drops down from the ceiling um, and is uh, able to retract back up whenever you're traveling. Um, as we come down here, we have our fridge and freezer combo. These are all electric, so no propane of any kind, no need to do any kind of leveling. Um, it is purely just 12 volt. Um, we've got our galley here. Now our galley has a lot of different options. Uh, the galley has things like our silverware and knives all stored nicely so that when we're bouncing around off-road, we're not worried about any of it. Same thing with our dishware up here. We have our quiet ride dish management that keeps everything protected as we're bouncing down the road. Um, and just a really nice large galley that's very easily customizable. All right, now one of the nice things about Earth Roamer is that this is all hand-built in our shop in Decono, Colorado. Um, we have a lot of very talented craftsmen who are building every asset of this, including um, the, uh, the shell is a one-piece carbon fiber shell uh, made in our composite shop. Um, all of our woodwork is done in-house by a very skilled craftsmen in the wood shop. Um, our upholstery, our chassis work, our fab, everything is going to be built in-house. So some of the things we can see in here are uh, we chose to do white oak in this truck, but we can also do things like alder or maple. It's all hardwood cabinetry. Um, customers can choose their materials like flooring and countertops and, and cushions. Uh, all, of the, all of the different things we can see here are customizable. So this here is our pass-through. So all earth roamers come standard with a pass-through. Um, that, act, that gives us access into the cab and access back into the camper from the cab whenever we need it. Again, this cab is going to be the Chevy 6500. Now it has been customized to make it feel a little more luxurious um, than a 6500 would come standard. Um, and then easy access back into the living area if you need to on the road. All right, so um, this entire truck is going to be running off of uh, solar panels. We have 1,600 watts of solar on the roof. Uh, as well as 18,000 watt hours of lithium ion batteries on board. That's amazing. Nice part about that is that we can uh, we can run all of the systems in here completely off grid. We don't have a generator on board because with the inverters, we are capable of running everything in here off of the solar nearly indefinitely. So that includes air conditioning, stove, microwave oven, washer dryer. Every major appliance you can think of is all going to be running off of the solar um, so as long as we don't have heavy set snow, and if we do, um, we you still have several days worth of stored capacity in the batteries. Amazing. Okay, so in the SX, we are now offering a dry bath option. So the dry bath is going to be the separate toilet from the shower area. And you can see in this one, 
uh, the shower has a rainfall shower. Um, that is going to be a little bit different than the LTI model that has the combo uh, wet bath. All right, so in the Earth Roamer SX, we have our new garage. Now in the rear here, this gives us eight feet across by almost two feet tall uh, and four feet wide of storage. That's gonna be awesome, especially if you're storing things in tubs um, or if we're storing large toys like kayaks, uh, bikes, skis, other things like that you might wanna take off grid. This is going to be our swing out storage box. So it's mounted to the bumper. But here I have access to, we put an exterior kitchen in this one. This one has got our Blackstone griddle. So this will come out and allow us to actually cook over in our campsite here. And it packs up really quick and easy. So we have our spare tire here. This is a full size 43 and a half inch spare from Goodyear. Um, a lot of people do ask. It is, uh, it's very easy to get down and change. The whole thing is mounted on a winch. So all we have to do is press a button and it lowers itself all the way down to the ground, making it a lot easier to roll around to wherever you need to put it on the truck. So this is our hand built front bumper. Um, it is all aluminum uh, and it is all hand TIG welded in house. Uh, we see that we have our lighting package here that includes Baja Designs linkable lights in the bar, as well as some of the XL80s and the squadrons down in the bumper. Also inside the bumper here, we've got the worn 16,500 pound winch with the synthetic line and a flat link from Factor 55. Uh, in the bumper, we also have a FLIR camera that's forward looking infrared, so that kind of gives us some night vision uh, when we're driving and we want to see animals on the side of the road. We also have a front bumper camera, access to our onboard air underneath the front bumper, just a lot of other things that are custom to this that makes it really nice to have on the front of a nurse armor. Okay, so uh, this entire truck has been coated with our in-house uh, material called X-Card. Uh, it's very similar to a truck bed liner. It's spray-on. Um, nice thing about it is that it is UV stable and it's a very hard surface, so it doesn't fade over time in the sun, and we can spray it in just about any color that a customer might want. Uh, it's really nice as we're pushing through trees or we're really getting off-road and we're, uh, we're doing some abuse to the outside of the truck to make it still look like it's new, especially on the carbon fiber shell. So new for 23, all earth roamers are gonna now be coming on the 43-inch tires from Goodyear. Um, What's really nice about these tires are they have a higher load rating than we used to have, as well as a higher speed rating. So now these are speed rated up to 82 miles an hour, meaning cruising down the highway is very easy. It's two finger driving in the 80 mile an hour range and uh, very easy to get across the country. Okay, so here we are in the driver's seat of the uh, Earth Roamer SX. Now everything's shut down at the moment, but some of the features we like to highlight are we have our 10.1 inch touchscreen from Kenwood here to replace the head unit. That's gonna give us wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Um, we have some other mounts up here for some other things like uh, maybe a Garmin Overlander if you want off-grid navigation. We've got controller for our uh, air ride over here. So we've got four corner independent air ride that can be used to level the truck when we get to camp as well. Uh, so we don't have to be stacking blocks or anything like that. Down in the center console, we have our GMRS radio or ham radio uh, and we also have uh, monitors for auxiliary fuel and tire pressure and temperature as well. So Zach as we wind this thing up uh, tell tell people where they can go if they have more questions want to look up more information about this thing. Absolutely so um, the best place to find all the information from us is going to be on our website it's earthroomer.com um, and uh, the earthroomer SX as you see it here Starting price is going to be just a little bit over a million. Um, and as optioned in this video, this one's going to be sitting about 1.1 million. So not uh, not a light decision to make, but uh, you do get a lot for the money. I do see that. Absolutely. All right, Zach, thanks for uh, helping out on this. Absolutely. Thank you so much for stopping by. You bet.